Hi everyone, this is Brendan here. So today we'll be talking about how to increase your search speed and also decrease your search timing. As some of you guys have been asking me how do I find those high loot bases really really quickly. So first of all, I'd like to mention that those videos that you guys have been watching are actually edited to the extent whereby I actually cut the videos and uh, show only the rates. So sometimes it takes me around 5 to 10 minutes to find those bases. Sometimes if it's really really quickly, I maybe uh, find it in just 3 to 5 minutes and if it takes too long I sometimes even take up to 20-30 minutes to find those bases so it just depends on um, the time of the day as to what time you actually play as uh, the timing is really important so uh, I'll talk about that in the next video as uh, you guys have also asked me what time is the good time to uh, farm for bases um, I'll mention about that next time so we'll proceed into uh, finding for a match and also explaining to you guys how do I do my search so first of all before I actually explain it um, bef whenever I do a search I'll usually zoom all the way into the screen uh, why do I do this because if I were to accidentally not press the next button if I do want the next and then I actually uh, touch over there I won't be able to deploy a troop and then it will just show you cannot uh, deploy any troops and then you won't accidentally deploy the troops and you'll be forced to attack the raid so usually I zoom all the way in um, up to the extent but I can still see the town hall and the surrounding uh, structures but I don't I won't be able to tap the screen to deploy a troop so three things that I look at when I actually do a search the first one is where is the town hall if the town hall is uh, not in the center so usually it's at the corner or at the side that I can snipe it sniping town hall as mentioned before it actually helps to increase your trophies and also maintain your trophies and eventually also give you loot bonus which is very very nice so the second thing that I look at is the resources the top left which uh, for me I set my target at 120,000 so um, now it's just around uh, 7,000 for that particular one it's rather low and now it is 4,000 so the third thing that I look at is uh, whether the defenses are armed such as the expo and the uh, Inferno Towers. So for the Expo, how you look at it, whether it's um, there's a small little rectangular box on the top of the Expo itself, whereby you can see a purple line over there. That's actually the arrows, the elixir arrows. So this one is armed because uh, there is the box over there. Whenever it's empty, there won't be any box over there. So um, for Inferno Towers itself, basically the top part over there, the red color uh, part, the orangey part, it won't be uh, it will be black if it's empty so this one you can see is armed so uh, another thing that I look at is where the resources are that one I also um, you need practice to actually uh, see it really quickly so um, I usually take around one second to look at the base scan through the base looking at those three factors determining whether I should attack the base and also um, you guys should actually uh, try to look for a better internet connection so like now I'm experiencing uh, seeing a slightly bad internet connection as you can see the uh, magnifying glass is appearing uh, quite some time to search for base so um, that's something to note for too so this base you can see the resources are in the storages it's quite hard to get this one is not a, not a resources um, collector's rate sorry so this one is also not it's a town hall 10 so just nexting really quickly looking at where the town hall is and also where the resources are and how much resources there are these are the factors that I actually looked at so just uh, looking at the time on the top it shows 29 seconds just roughly taking around 0 0.5 seconds to 1 second to uh, press the next button so I've been uh, doing this for such a long time whereby I'm really used to it and of course uh, this requires a lot of practice and the starting when I uh, was uh, doing this um, I roughly take around 3 seconds to 5 seconds to scan through the base and then after that if, uh, when I start to try to um, train myself to reduce the time um, I did skip some uh, high rate bases as I wasn't used to uh, searching it this fast so as you can see now this is a 66,000 go I know it's going to be quite fast and you guys uh, might not be able to see it but if you guys want you can review the video by uh, replaying it again so this is a 53,000 as Town Hall 8 the Town Hall is an outside so we will see um, for the next one as you can see now it's 180,000 it's a Town Hall 10 and the Town Hall is inside not going to snipe that Town Hall inside 2100 DE though but uh, the DE storage was inside so I didn't go for it of course and uh, if you guys are wondering whether I voice over this uh, video it's not voice over at all it's basically all searching live right now me talking ov over um, uh, the live search so it's not any um, voice over anything okay so this one you can see the town hall is definitely outside because the center has the research lab so we, for this one we can just uh, snipe the town hall maybe dropping some archers and after that dropping my queen so 
basically this is how I actually uh, do my search and of course uh, sniping of uh, this town hall will get me some resources and also push my trophies up so I've gained uh, 6 trophies and of course getting uh, 50,000 uh, resources so now we see whether you can find a high resource base as uh, now you see I have to zoom back in otherwise I will I might accidentally re uh, deploy a troop so um, we will see as how it goes we see whether we can find a a high resource base uh, if we can't find a high resource base maybe i would lower my standard so that uh, you guys won't wait too long so now it's at eighty five thousand, and then uh, hopefully be able to do a raid for you guys before this video ends so uh, this is a town hall 10 and not not too uh, high in resources um town hall 10 also not too high in resources town hall is inside so just scanning the base really quickly not the trying to let the cloud go all the way out and then after they just close back in uh, this is how I actually time myself to make myself uh, search faster so uh, I've been doing this for um, like a few months uh, more than a year in fact uh, farming so I've been really really used to it and in fact playing on my iPad will be much faster okay so this is uh, Town Hall 7 um, I could show you guys uh, me reading this but of course uh, you know, guys can see that it takes quite a while to search a base because uh, now at this timing uh, of the day it's not very easy to find a base so we will just go ahead to attack this uh, base with a uh, BAM army. So let's see whether we can um, destroy this base right now. So deploying our troops. I don't think I'll deploy in my standard manner, just uh, deploying in this particular manner. Should be able to, to take this base out relatively easily. So just continuing. Um, why I actually want to share with you guys how to increase your search timing is because uh, if you guys actually be able to search quicker, then you'll be able to have more opportunity to find high resource bases quicker. So for example, uh, for me, I take like roughly around, um, roughly around in one minute, I do around 20 searches because including the loading time is roughly three seconds per base. Whereas uh, if you were to take your time to look at the base, scan the base, take roughly 10 seconds and then including the loading time, maybe do around 13 seconds to, to search for one base, you will be able to see only four bases in one minute. So if I see 20 and you see 4 bases, um, what are the chances of me and you finding a high rate basis quicker? So that's something to note for. So I mean, um, you guys want to know how do I search that quickly. So basically that's how do I do it. Looking at those uh, few factors, hopefully you guys can also practice. And then after that, uh, make use of this strategy to implement into your farming strategy. Uh, army as also uh, reviewing my previous tutorials too so with that said i'd like to thank you guys for watching my video and clash on